Hey, how's it going everyone? I want to talk about Display Recorder. It's a classic jailbreak app for the iPhone that allows you to record your display. Go figure. Display Recorder is a very robust jailbreak app because it includes just a lot of different features for recording your display. Not only is it just a simple display recorder, not only can you just record the action on your iPhone, but you can do a lot more than that. You can even control your iPhone from your PC or your Mac via a web server. I'm going to show you how you can do that as well. And that's all built into the functionality of Display Recorder. So I've already installed Display Recorder. Let's go to our settings app and check out some of the settings of Display Recorder so you can see what this app has to offer. Now, what I like about this, right off the bat at the top, there's a user's guide because like I said, this is pretty robust. You got a lot of advanced features here. So you, you can check out the user guide if you need more assistance with using this jailbreak app. Not only that, you have uh, a lot of different options here. You have rotation, you can switch between portrait, landscape, etc. You have the video format, the popular H.264 format, which I like to use. You have your video quality, and I'll set that to high. And OpenGL capture, that allows you to capture OpenGL um, items such as, you know, games and things like that. So that's a nice feature. You have grayscale, then you have your scale, you can see full size, half size. Uh, show taps. You ever see those videos where you have the little white tap, you know, whenever somebody taps a button on the iPhone screen, you see a little white circle. Well, that's what that is. You can enable show taps when recording, always, etc. You can have the tap size. You can change that, that little circle to a different size. And then what's nice about this is that there's an activation method that you can set up. Now, once you install Display Recorder, there will be an app icon on your home screen that you can go into and then you can enable recording that way or you can assign it an activator toggle, just like that. So what this allows you to do is to, to use a normal activator action to enable display recorder. So for instance, if I set you know, the home button, a double press of the home button, if I activate that, then anytime I double pressed on my home button down here, then display recorder would start recording my iPhone's display. So that's really handy if you use display recorder a lot, if you need to record your iPhone's display more often than not, you're going to want to go with an activator toggle there. And let's not forget what I already mentioned, the web server functionality. That allows you actually to set up your Mac or your PC to display what's on your iPhone screen right on your computer. Now that's really handy. Now not only can you just display it, you can actually control your iPhone from your Mac or PC using just a browser when you connect to the web server. And I'll show you how you can do that as well. So let's get out to Display Recorder. Let me just show you how this works. Here is the actual app right there. And you can see right here below where I do have the web server enabled. This is the web server address that you're gonna to wanna to go to on your PC or your Mac. You just put that in your browser and then you'll be able to see your actual display right there in real time. And everything you do on your iPhone, you'll see on your Mac or PC and vice versa. So that's really convenient and that's that's an awesome way to get you know recordings of your iPhone onto the web or et cetera, et cetera, whatever you wanna do. So to enable a new recording, all you do is hit the plus sign here and it's gonna ask you if you wanna start recording the display, okay, yes. All right, so now you're actually recording, you can see the little white dot there. And if I go back out to my home screen, of course, you're still recording. So if I open up a Safari browser, you know, I'm browsing jailbreak movies, you can still see me recording jailbreak movies. So if I go to a particular link, you can see all that. Now all that is recorded just like, you know, it looks just like you're doing it in real time, except it's being recorded, of course. And like I said, all this is also visible on your Mac or PC via your browser if you have the web server set up, as you'll see right here. You see that? So all that's all set up and um, it's very easy to use. Display Recorder, like I said, it costs $4.99. I highly recommend this app if you have any need whatsoever to record your iPhone's display. You're not gonna get any better than this. I'm gonna go ahead and stop the recording. Okay, all right, so the recording's completed and then you have the recording here, it's 11 megabytes and it tells you the time, etc. Now, if you tap that, it gives you several options. You can delete the recording, you can upload it to YouTube, you can play the video, or you can even add it to your camera roll. So lots of different functionality, lots of different options for you right there. I'll just play the video. Let's just take a look at what we did. 
And then of course you can put this out over AirPlay too. So once again, folks, this is Display Recorder, highly recommended app, one of the best jailbreak apps you're gonna find on the City of Store. Let me know what you think about it. This is Jeff with jailbreakmovies.com. Have you ever wished you could receive an alert when your iPhone is fully charged? So have I. Fortunately, now you can. There's a new jailbreak tweak entitled Full Charge Alert, and it's available on Cydia now. Check out this next video for a full rundown of Full Charge Alert, and also make sure you subscribe.